What's good, gamers? Welcome back to Fizzy MTG. Guys, today we're going to be taking a look at this deck. Ooh, what could this deck be, you ask? I don't know. I honestly do not remember. We're going to look at the... Uh, okay, we got all mountains here, so... Um, let's see. Let me just find, uh... Okay. All right. I just need to see one card and I know what the deck is typically. So, uh, yeah, let's get on in here. Come on. Come on. All right. Get that nice little zoom there. Oh, we got a Montana. We got one. We got two. We got three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen, fourteen, fifteen, sixteen, seventeen, eighteen, nineteen. 19 there we go that's that's like my standard that's my go-to i like 19 lands it just feels right to me most of the time now this is kind of the star player of this deck for me this is the card kind of that i got the idea uh to try this with and this deck does actually perform fairly well in a lot of situations so we got a, a goblin warrior with trample he's a one one play him for one and goblin gavalier that's his name gets plus two plus zero for each equipment attached to it so you know obviously uh the equipment could add defensive capabilities as well as offensive capabilities as well but he will also get pumped just for having them on him which is really nice uh i should update this deck now that we have living equipment because that would be sick as heck uh and make a lot more of this deck probably easier to use i didn't think about that until just now but you know what it's all good we're gonna look at it before that has happened to it but anyway, that's the first card. We've also got Geo Surge. Pay four mana, and then you add seven mana to your mana pool. Spend this mana only to cast artifacts or creature spells. Spoiler alert, that's probably mostly what this deck has. And then we got Barbed Battle Gear. Equipped creature gets plus four, minus one. <laughs> so you might be wondering, like, what the heck? That would just kill the creature straight out of the gate. Well, you're right. So this can't be my first equipment or he dies, <laughs> which is kind of funny. Uh, volcanic Strength, Enchant Creature. Enchant Creature gets plus two, plus two, and has Mountain Walk. <laughs> that could be very, very useful. And, uh, you know, give our boy a little bit more strength. Now we've also got Cathar Shield. Uh, equipped Creature gets plus zero, plus three, and has Vigilance equipped for three. Very nice. I love this. Uh, it's a zero cost. Uh, equipment, but you have to equip it for three, so it's, it can be very useful. And then we got, uh, I don't know how you say that, GM Day's Tone? I have never, I don't think I've ever read the name of this card out loud. I don't know. If you guys know how to pronounce that, let me know in the comments. You pay for, tap it, draw a card. I just, I love it, honestly. Uh, Soul Bright Flamekin. Uh, you can pay two, target creature gains trample until the end of turn. If this is the third time this ability has resolved this turn, you may add... Eight mana, I think, to your mana pool. Eight red mana. Very sick. Very sick. Avacyn's Collar. Equipped creature gets plus one, plus zero, and has vigilance whenever equipped creature dies. If it was a human, put a 1-1 one, one white spirit creature token with flying onto the battlefield. Equipped for two. We've got a screaming shield. Ah! <laughs> equipped creature gets plus zero, plus three, and has... Pay two, tap, target player, puts the top three cards of their library into their graveyard, equipped for three. So you can kind of see where my head was at with this deck. Because he pumps himself, I don't really need to worry about the attack whenever I equip him. So if I can find stuff that pump his defense, that's kind of, yeah, see, a quarter shield. Equipped creature gets plus zero, plus three, and has vigilance. See, this is kind of what I was thinking. Pay three to equip. And uh, he's just got another zero cost, too, which is pretty sick. He's just going to get bigger and bigger the more stuff I can put on him anyway. So why not pump up his defenses so that I can start pumping his attack even more crazily? Equipped creature has double strike. And you equip for two. <laughs> yeah, and if you get this boy all equipped up, oh my god, it gets insane. Indestructible. Equipped creature gets plus two, plus zero. Uh, very nice. Silver skin armor. Equipped creature gets plus one, plus one. And... Ha and is an artifact in addition to its other types. Equipped for two. Warlord's Axe. Equipped creature gets plus three, plus one. Uh, equipped for four. Very nice. Veteran Armament. Equipped creature has whenever this creature attacks or blocks. It gets plus one, plus one until the end of the turn for each attacking creature. Whenever a soldier creature comes into play, you may attach Veteran's Armaments to it. 
If only it was a warrior. That would be sick. Spider Silk Net. Equip creature gets plus zero, plus two, and has reach. Very, very useful. Equip for two. We've got a good old Brawler's Plate. Equip creature gets plus two, plus two, and has trample. It can. Oh, yeah. You guys, you guys know how trample worked. Uh, and you equip it for four. Very snazzy. We got a turret ogre. This guy, pretty good. He's got reach, and when turret ogre enters the battlefield, if you control another creature with power four or greater, turret ogre deals two damage to each opponent. So, you know, useful in multiplayer for sure. Uh, ruined uh, stala stalactite, I guess. Yeah, it's got to be stalactite, right? I always thought it was stalactite, but I guess it's stalactite. I don't know. Unless that's just a different thing. Uh, equipped creature gets plus one, plus one has... Oh, and is every creature type. Ho, ho. Very cool. Tribal, tribal, whatever. Uh, and we got another one of these boys. Because what if our main boy gets gone? Or we want to, like, split the... You know, spread the love, baby. Hashtag spread the love, dog. Yeah. Brimstone Trebuchet. I, I love this card. This is great. Just I ping you for one card. It's very nice. Uh, Defender with reach. Tap Brimstone Trebuchet. Deals one damage to each opponent. Whenever a knight enters the battlefield under control... Untap Brimstone Trebuchet. You know, useful. We got a Leonin Scimitar. Equipped creature gets plus one, plus one. Equipped for one, and it costs one. Very nice. Consulate Skygate. It is a defender with reach. I love those. Always useful. Kite Sail. Equipped creature gets plus one, plus zero, and has flying. Always good. Equips for two. Razor Boomerang. Equipped creature has tap, unattached Razor Boomerang. Razor Boomerang. Deals one damage to target creature or player. Return Razor Boomerang to its owner's hand. Equipped for two. You know, just a nice little card there. Ring of Valkaz. Equipped creature has haste, which is very useful. At the beginning of your upkeep, put a 1-1 one, one counter on equipped creature if it's red. Oh, 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 I wonder if our... Oh, yeah, it's mono red, of course. Equipped for one. Staff of the Flame Magus. Whenever you cast a red spell or a mountain enters the battlefield under your control, you gain one life. Stuff, I guess, always useful. See, these are cool. This is kind of like, I guess, the original or like the start of the uh, like equipment creatures, kind of. This is a living weapon. When this equipment enters the battlefield, put a 0-0 zero, zero black germ creature token onto the battlefield, then attach this to it. Equipment creature gets plus X, plus X. Where X is the number of creature cards in all graveyards. So, <laughs> this is going to be very useful. And it equips for two, which is really cool. Good old standard short sword. you got to have one of those in every RPG you play. I mean, if you don't get a short sword, what kind of game is it? What kind of RPG is it? Equip creature gets plus one, plus one. And you equip it for one. So, you know, standard. Marauder's X. Equip creature gets plus two, plus zero. Equip for two. We've got a Golem's Heart. Whenever a player casts an artifact spell, a player, that's very useful, you may gain one life. So you don't have to gain it, but you could. And there's a couple here, because I like to double up on my life gain when I can. <laughs> Turret Ogre, we already know what this boy does. He's good. We got a Hedron Blade. Whenever a equipped creature gets, sorry, equipped creature gets plus one, plus one. Whenever a equipped creature becomes blocked by one or more colorless creatures, it gains death touch. Uh-oh, we did a little flippy there. Until the end of turn, uh, equipped for two. Very cool. I don't know why it decided to flippy, but it did. I don't know if you guys saw that or if it, if it shows in the video or not. We'll see. Heart Piercer Bow. Whenever equipped creature deals... Uh, oh, sorry. Creature attacks. Heart Piercer Bow deals one damage to target creature defending player controls. Equipped for one. Very useful. Pristine Talisman. Tap. Add one colorless to your mana pool. You gain one life. Very, very nice. We got ourselves another flying defender, or not flying defender, but reaching defender, I think. Yeah. Another turret ogre. We got a jawbone skullkin, which is a really cool little scarecrow guy. Pay two, target red creature gains haste till the end of turn. Always useful. Another goblin gavalier and a relic axe. Let's see. Whenever relic axe enters the battlefield, attach it to target creature you control. Equip creature gets plus one, plus one. If it is a warrior, it gets plus two, plus one instead. Our boy is a warrior, and this is the last card in the deck. Equipped for two, baby! Woo! So, what do you guys think of this crazy uh, goblin equipment deck? It's uh, I had some fun with goblins, uh, and you guys will see more of that probably in coming videos. If they haven't already gone up, I don't know what order these are going up. Uh, but hopefully you guys are enjoying these because I'm making a lot of them. <laughs>
I really hope you guys enjoy. If you do, let me know in the comments. Let me know what kind of deck I should build. Uh, what kind of decks are you guys building? What is your favorite tribe? I think mine is honestly spiders. And uh, don't worry, guys. We're going to get to a spider deck. Don't worry. It's going to be It's gonna be there. In a video coming up soon, probably, if it's not already, already out on the channel. I don't know. I do love me some spiders. But anyway, that's going to do it for this video. If you guys enjoyed, leave a like, comment, consider subscribing, all that good junk. I will see you guys hopefully in the comments uh, and in the next one. Hope you guys have a great day. Later.